office, but the importance of going to play an opponent like Texas A&M, just cutting out the mistakes that, that may have cost you guys the game last week. Yeah, definitely. All the mistakes, you know, penalties, everything that we caused to hurt ourselves, everything that we did to hurt ourselves to lose that game last week, everything has to be eliminated to go and win this week at Texas A&M. Uh, it shouldn't be that tough for us to really eliminate those penalties, though, because that was just all us. It wasn't anything on them that they did. It was just all us fumbling the ball and the ball go. Myself and a couple others with the holding penalties, and those have to be cut out. Uh, yeah, that's what we have to do to go with. It seemed like the, the, the one drive was like, it got really backed up, like third and 47, yeah. I think it was. What, what, what happened on that drive? Uh, actually, all the penalties were on myself, actually. Um, one was a face, uh, hands to the face, and two were holding. Um, rather not, they were fair calls or not, I won't comment on, but they were called, and that's just what. That's just to give him a football. And obviously you can't have that against the Aggies, I mean. No. How did you feel going to your first game? Did you feel comfortable in that offensive line with your unit? Did you yeah, definitely. The they really gave us as a unit a chance to really mesh up front. So that's why I think we played the way that we did. Um, even our defense, I think that we really got a chance to mesh all around as a team, as a unit. Um, our offensive line, though, as in a specific unit, yeah, we definitely had more than enough time to match. We played well together. Um, we have fun out there. Really, we do. It was my first college Division One football game, so I didn't know what to expect. So after the first couple snaps, I was, I was comfortable again. I was on the field just ready to go having fun. Is the way you guys played against a team like Rutgers and a Big East team sort of relieve all that pressure? Is it like a way off your shoulders heading into the next uh, non-conference game? The weight's never off. It's always there. It's always got to win. Kaylin, your coach and uh, during the training camp described you as someone that you know has a mean streak that definitely knows how to play nasty. Is that something that you've always had? Is that something that you've acquired throughout the year? Uh, some, that's something I've always heard since I played football from like kick up from every single coach that I've ever had. Um, I think it's just I like to hit people. I like to run after the ball, and when I get a chance to hit somebody in the open field, I do it. Um, so when I hear the whistle, sometimes I get called for it, like a holding. But most of the time, it's not anything after the whistle and anything illegal. So I do it and it works out.